Hello students, following questions are one more question from topic of Mohr circle of mechanics of material but the difference here is that it this talks about Mohr circle of strain. Here it is given that there is a block, a two dimensional block which is subjected to zero strains in x and y direction but it is subjected to shear strain of magnitude 3 into 10 to the power minus 6. So it is asked that what will be the diameter of Mohr circle of strain that is resulting because of present strains. Now if we talk about the principal strains, they are given by epsilon xx plus epsilon yy by 2 plus minus epsilon xx minus epsilon yy by 2 square plus gamma by 2 square. This is the difference between Mohr circle mo, between the principal stress equation I must say principal equation for stresses and strain respectively that there we used to have a tau square here we have gamma by 2 square all other terms remaining same so this is the trick for this question we get principal strains as plus minus gamma by 2 because these terms are 0 this is 0 this also reduces to 0 so it comes out as plus minus gamma by 2 so if we plot Mohr circle corresponding to these strains it will be something like this that here we will be having one point here will be having one point and Mohr circle will be passing through these principal strains that is the basic fundamental of Mohr strain. Now we know these two points. This is the origin. We can easily calculate diameter as sum of R plus R that is two equidistant points from origin. So D is R plus R or 2R where R is given by value of a principal strain which is 3 by 2 10 to the power minus 6. So diameter comes out as 3 into 10 to the power minus 6 making C as the correct choice for question number 6. Thank you.